What's up guys, just back with another video. I hope you guys are doing well today. Happy Sunday. Uh, hopefully you're enjoying your weekend. It's really nice weather out here uh, this weekend. It's usually the, the time of year we get like a really big heat wave here in Hamilton or Southern Ontario in, in general, but it's actually really nice out today. So I hope you guys are enjoying that. <clears throat> I just wanted to um, kind of follow up on the uh, interview that RFK Jr. had with uh, Jimmy Dore about, say about a week ago now. Uh, and one of the, th the things I wanted to touch on about in kind of like a separate video is how uh, RFK Jr. and Jimmy Dore slash Max Blumenthal all, all kind of disagree on the Israel-Palestine issue. Now, honestly, I have no opinion on this, but I do want to talk uh, today about how uh, when RFK Jr. and Jimmy Dore were kind of debating that a little bit, uh, RFK Jr. did say that he would love to talk to and have an interview or debate rather with uh, Max Blumenthal. Now, I've been following Max Blumenthal for probably about a year. He's a really even keeled, good journalist, speaks his mind, speaks the truth, doesn't sugarcoat anything, doesn't exaggerate. I think he's a really good, um, I think he's a good interview and I think he's a really good journalist and I'm really looking forward to see a, a, a debate between Max Blumenthal and RFK Jr. because I think that we'll learn a lot. Even if you already are well informed on this issue, you're still going to learn something from those two because they're both brilliant, they're both well-spoken, they're both respectful. I know it's kind of more entertaining when you see two people debate and it gets really uh, heated up and really they get really fired up and start insulting each other. Yeah, that can be entertaining sometimes, but you know what? It's also really nice to see a respectful debate as well. And I think that's what we're going to get with uh, Max Blumenthal and, uh, and uh, RFK Jr. So I'm really looking forward to that. I'm really looking forward to learning a little bit more about this issue because it seems very complicated to me. Uh, it, looks, it seems like it's been happening for a very, very long time. And when I hear RFK Jr. speak about it, it's like, okay, I guess he's making some points. And then I hear Max Blumenthal say why he's wrong, and I'm like, okay, I, I would love to hear them debate just so I can learn more because I don't quite um, understand the issue uh, as much as I should, although I haven't really researched it that much. Um, but I am looking forward to their conversation because I think it's going to be very informative. It's going to be very respectful. I think we're all going to learn a lot. And uh, I don't know when it's going to happen. There's no date set on it yet, but I do believe he'll probably have it on as soon as Jimmy gets back from tour because I think he's he's starting his tour very soon if it's not started already. So, And I know he's actually coming to Toronto. I was trying to get uh, tickets for that, but they were all sold out. So... But I'm glad that he's coming here. I think that uh, people in Toronto who get to go see him are going to really enjoy him. I think he's going to enjoy being in Canada as well. Probably not enjoy the uh, <laughs> the current politicians that are in place, but he'll probably have some things to say about that. And I'm looking forward to um, not seeing him live, but I'm sure there's going to be a video of it. So I'm looking forward to watching that. Anyway, guys, I don't want to keep uh, rambling on too long, but RFK Jr. and Max Blumenthal's interview is definitely going to be good. It's going to be informative, and it's going to be respectful, and I think we're all going to learn a lot. Um, let me know in the comment section, by the way, if you know anything about the Palestine-Israel issue, because I would love to learn and read up on that, and a lot of you guys are very informed, um, which I do appreciate that. So please uh, you know, leave something in the comment section. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching, guys, and I'll be back soon with another video.